Hey, Catherine. So I'm back. Hey, sorry this took me so long, <clears throat> but I don't know if you uh, realize, but apparently I'm just an invalid and I'm sick again. I have bronchitis. So excuse the raspy, booey Armstrong thing I have going. Banana, 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 banana. I don't know if you'll be able to hear this, but in the background of this video, we'll be playing um, Camille and Circuit's new CD, Still Got Lakes. If you haven't gotten it, or you don't know what Camille and Circuit is, but I don't see how you could not know what Camille and Circuit is. I mean, you're you, so, but it's so good. So if you haven't gotten it, please totally get it. Updates. Toronto. I am going to be in Toronto from August 5th to August 9th, which I know is only like four days, but that Monday, which I think is like the 6th or 7th or something, I don't know, I'm really bad with dates. I'm as bad as John Green, just like, it's bad. That Monday, I'm going to have the whole entire day free. Hopefully you're not working, that would be cool. Hey. But if you are, we can meet up after you work or something, I don't know. Well, I'm sure we'll work it out. I'm sure it will be fine. <laughs> My thick. <sighs> I shouldn't be allowed to work in the fandom ever again. I'm so bad at this. So I have 10,000 words done and I frantically wrote them to get the first draft in a day late. That was why my last update was so late. I have not touched that at all yet, again. I hate myself. Uh, but so I have 10,000 words. And I know where the story's going. Like, And every time I look at it, or every time I think about it, I'm like too worried to actually write it. And then my artist just emailed me and was like, hey, so what's going on? And I was like, <laughs> My mom, Tuesday, went in for her surgery. She got a surgery on her hand. So I'm nursing her while I'm sick. So it's hilarious. It's the blind leading the blind over here in the O'Brien household. Yeah, my brother's vacuuming, sorry. School is coming back up soon, which is gonna be crazy. I'm not, I'm, I'm excited about it, but I'm equally, apprehensive about the actual school part more about like living in the apartment with my friends I really like my friends don't get me wrong obviously just it's stressful and the idea that I have to make a whole entire apartment within like five days once I show up there is kind of freaking me out a little bit and actually I have some clips from the past couple of weeks that I've been putting together so here's a little montage of the past couple of weeks for me It's time to take a shower. I, uh, I'm gonna go to the doctor's and I have to go to work. It's gonna be a really exciting day. Now it's time to pick a dress. Woohoo! Into my brother's room. Because I don't actually have my own closet anymore. This one. Ha! ha. My miracle dress. And so here I am, in all of my wonderful dressed up glory. The glory of our sunny New Orleanian neighborhood. Oh, that's Ducky, by the way. It's my car. <laughs> we live in suburbia, basically, so it's all birds and grass and pretty flowers um, anyways this week my parents and my brother are off in Las Vegas they're in Las Vegas because the Louisiana State Bar which is our lawyers associations our general meeting this year is in Las Vegas so that's where they are you know usually I'd go with them and I'm gonna go to Toronto for the ABA meeting so my mom was like, you can't go to the Las Vegas meeting, which means that I have the house to myself. I don't think you fully appreciate how awesome that is. We have that horrible sun. I know you can't really tell, but right now it's probably about 87 degrees. I'm not going to convert that to whatever you guys use up there. It's not going to happen, but it's hot. I have to do a bunch of shit because my parents are out of the town. I'm not pleased. I live on Al Shore in the Beverly Knoll Association neighborhood. Beverly Knoll, Catherine. The name of our neighborhood association is Beverly Knoll. 
think that really speaks for itself, don't you? And here we are, back at my humble abode, after walking in a circle. Don't tell the dog, she'll never know. No, it wasn't that good fun. Hopefully, you're doing well, and everything's going well up there. Happy, happy, happy birthday. I realized it was your birthday and was like, okay, today has to be the day I make this video and post it for her. So, happiest of all happy birthdays, okay? Be awesome. I will see you soon. I'm very excited about it. See ya. Oh my god, I almost left this vlog without saying it. Happy vlog, Catherine.